Motion Blur by Runway ML is finally available for public. Runway ML is one of the leading AI video editing apps where you can turn your text into a video, you can turn an image into a video, and now you can just brush over a part of an image and it can turn into a video. Runway ML just last week teased on their Twitter where they just had a demo video showing how you can just brush over clouds or anything else and it just turned that part of the picture into an animated four second video instantly. So if you've been following me on TikTok Instagram, you know when I posted this video last week, it went bonkers. Everybody's been asking for a tutorial. It's gonna be my first impression as well. I know I just got access and let's do a first view together. You wanna go to runwayml.com and then you can sign up for free you have limited number of credits that you get when you sign up for a new account that does not require a credit card. Here you have different models that they have. Then you have access to the different tools you want to try. You have some tutorials and some of their pre-used or like pre-done images that you can use just to like demo some stuff. All these images, all these videos are all generated by this particular AI tool. I know it's part of their Gen 2 model. I'm just going to try just text image to video. Here I see their Gen 2 model. Open it up and we have access to the motion brush feature which is in beta right now. Here what you can do is you can add anything, any text and the text will turn into a video. For example, this video or this video. I think all these are examples and you can see the prompt they have used in the bottom here to generate this video or you can add an image and it will turn that into a video so to use motion brush we have to add an image what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna use one of their images from here or I'll see if I have something in my asset section okay I'm gonna go find an image we can use mid journey showcase I'm just gonna pick an image from mid journey that we can try in our demo and see how it adds the video effect to an AI generated image I like this one I mean they're all pretty cool I'm just gonna take a screenshot of couple of these images and now I'm just gonna add an image here okay we have our image now let's use the motion brush feature control a specific area with motion brush brush over an area to apply motion controls specifically you don't need to be precise tap anywhere to begin we can adjust our brush size we have an eraser and this controls where the motion is gonna happen like you know if, if it's gonna be a vertical animation or a video if it's gonna be on the vertical size and I'm not sure what proximity means but I'm assuming like which proximity around the brushed area that's going to change so let's start with just the clouds in the background here maybe actually let's try the vertical one let's add the vertical one and let's see if it changes this way it's going to give us an idea if that's how these tools are working let's save this and generate four seconds uh, i've been using this tool quite a lot i still have 67 seconds left it resets every month wait 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 i think for social media posts and all that stuff it's pretty cool if you just want to add a bit of like dynamic elements to your static posts you know maybe if you're having a teams page on your website you have some backgrounds maybe you want to change the background add a bit more dynamicity to it these are like all cool use cases you can do and of course if you are like hardcore video editor you know photographer like that creative mind i'm sure you're gonna find a lot more use cases for this tool runway ml they do their own competitions where like people have been using these tools like runway ml to generate the whole films like short films just using these like AI generated videos. Like I think they do show showcases once in a while. If you get a chance, take a look at those competitions where people have been doing some crazy storytelling just using AI. It's insane. Okay, now our video is loaded. It's time to play. Oh yeah, we were right. Now the clouds are moving in the background. We can see it's vertical. You know, let's rate the results. I'm pretty, I think it's pretty good. So let's give them some feedback. Let's say if we can add more motion to the same image. So we have this added. And if I want to like select these clouds as well, and I change the direction to horizontal, let's see what happens. Also, you can play with the camera setting motion too. Basically, like, you know, if you do horizontal, vertical, roll or zoom, it's going to change the overall image itself. So I'm just gonna zoom out a little bit. Gonna up the speed a little bit. I don't know what's gonna happen, so we'll find out. So let's use another four seconds. So every time you generate a video with AI, you get a four second video. You can extend the video to a maximum of 16 seconds. So you can do three consecutive generations per video and then 20 credits per generation. And on the free plan, you're gonna get this watermark at the bottom as well, you know, which makes sense. I know these tools are not cheap. Let me know in the comment, what do you think about this tool, this new feature? 
future in what use cases you've been using this tool, what you like about it, what you don't like about it. I would just love to hear your thoughts. You know, I'm not affiliated with this company in any way. Now, there's some really cool stuff. We get the zoom out feature. We're getting the horizontal movement. We're getting the vertical movement. This looks super cool. I mean, the image itself is super cool too, but I think this is pretty cool. Subscribe to the channel if you want to become an AI marketer. Uh, my goal is to share practical only use cases to how AI could be used to better yourself, to be a better marketer. I'm an entrepreneur and creator, and I know we all want to be better ourselves to survive in this economy. Peace.